desire of the empty battles I once craved. I wander, outcast, while my tribe curses the gods who abandoned us. Our home is in ruins, yet I stand firm. Six days ago, the falling star struck the town of Tristram. The dead rose in its wake. What evil is this? Could it be what I have sought these long years? A foe worthy of my blade. Gods are in all things, and everywhere I see signs of change. The wind bears an unnatural chill, and my people grow uneasy. Now, fire burns the sky and scorches the vault of the heavens. I must carry out the will of the Patriarchs. When they need to see, I am their eyes. Where they wish to strike, I am their fist. When they would ignite the light of truth, I am their torch. They have sent me to where the heavenly fire has fallen. My mind is clear. I will rid Tristram of the shambling corpses that have risen in the fire's wake. I wander to places beyond imaginings. From the jungles of my youth. My knowledge has grown vast. The people, they think me banished, shunned to the end of my days. They say I defy the spirits, but I say no. I follow them. Spirits show me alone that the sky fire is where the end begins. They say this must not be. I live to serve the spirits. So I go. 
There is none but me to answer the call. Since my youth, I have been told that I was special. A prodigy of vast potential. I came to the Ishari Sanctum, seeking what knowledge I could glean from the Masters. But I found them fearful of the truth. I would learn nothing from them. The old books, the prophecies they contained, showed me all that might come to pass, and all that I might become. Then, a star fell from the heavens, the sign that my moment had come. I will go west to Tristram, to stop the darkness that the star portends and fulfill the destiny that beckons me.